Well, it's official. I can't take it any longer where I'm at. So I've decided to rent an executive apartment in downtown Vancouver just to chill and get a change of scenery. I don't know about you, but uh, change of scenery is good. And these $400 a night <laughs> apartments are not $400 a night anymore. They're like 100 ish and I can bring my dog. So my dog's never been on an elevator before, so this could be fun. I got lots of poop bags <laughs> ready because the dog's gonna have to do her business outside on the concrete jungle in downtown Vancouver, so we'll see how that works out. Anywho. Well, hi ho RVers. Today I'm coming to you from my executive apartment in downtown Vancouver. Why? Because I got tired of the RV lifestyle and they are renting these places out crazy, crazy, crazy cheap. These places are normally 400 bucks a night. Woo! But <laughs> I'm slumming here because it's cheaper. Oh, oh, there's my walk-in closet. You know, if you added up the bathroom space and walk-in closet space is bigger than my RV. But uh, anyway, I'm in the hallway here. That's, that's my bathroom. Um, not much to see there other than the tub. But I'm loving it. It's great. I've got lots of amenities. Great place to hang out for a little while. And it's even dog friendly. Hey, Sammy, dog friendly. They even allow dogs. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm in the concrete urban jungle here with Sammy the Pooper. But let me give you a little tour of what we got here for the accoutrements. So we got a big kitchen here with the induction range. Totally induction. We got the Keurig. Got the Keurig. Gotta have, gotta have the Keurigs. Got beautiful 14 foot ceiling. Nice little uh, lighting system here. We even got an oven. Of course, you gotta have a microwave, but you know, who's gonna do the dishes? So the dishes are done in that little mini dishwasher. That's pretty swanky. I like that. And then we got our little seating area where I'm gonna have my breakfast with Tiffany. <laughs> who's Tiffany? I don't know. Maybe I'll meet her later. Now let's talk about the business end of things here. This is the bedroom here. Uh, all the typical things that you need, like pillows and blankets and whatnot. But take a look at the ceiling. Woo! 14-footers! Okay, this is the living area where I guess I'll be living. <laughs> and this is where Sammy is living. Hey, Sammy, what are you going to do with all this room? Hey, what are you going to do with that? <laughs> and we do have a balcony here, which is very nice get a little fresh air the dog likes it you know check it out washer and dryer oh yeah i'll be washing and drying to my heart's content i even brought some detergent oh yeah big closet here the big double closet everything i need ironing board iron i got all the small appliances too they were Pretty smart to fully equip this place with what I needed. Hey Sammy, what are you doing? What are you doing? What am I going to do with all this space? Hey Sam, what are you going to do? I'm going to have to figure out who I'm going to get for some pizza delivery tonight because I don't feel like cooking too much, but whatever. I'll be here for a while. So this is home base for now. Yeah, I'm selling out. I'm totally selling out. What can I say? Hey. 
I wouldn't normally pay 400 bucks a night for this place, but while the COVID-19 thing is rolling, there are some exquisite deals to be had for rental properties all over the world. So I suggest you get on that bandwagon, get a change of scenery, because that is why I'm here, because I needed a change of scenery. I was getting tired of uh, where I was at, so in the meantime, stay safe, keep your wheels on the ground. I'll talk to you soon from downtown Vancouver, over and out.